terrified at 32,000 feet. The sound of rushing air from outside filling the cabin of Southwest Airlines Flight 1380. Passengers using oxygen masks after an engine has just exploded, sending shrapnel smashing through a window. One woman passenger was partially sucked out of the window after the explosion and later died. The dramatic events caught in the conversation between the pilot, Tammy Joel Schultz, and the control tower. Yeah, we have a part of the aircraft missing, so we're going to need to slow down a bit. Could you have the uh, medical meet us there on the runway as well? We've got uh, injured passengers. Injured passengers, okay. And are you, is your airplane physically on fire? No, it's not on fire, but part of it's missing. They said there was a hole and, and uh, someone went out. Um, I'm sorry, you said there was a hole and somebody went out? The pilot made an emergency landing at Philadelphia Airport. The damage to the front of the engine, which exploded clear to see as accounts of the terrifying events emerged. When we saw the window was gone, somebody saw the lady out the window, so just tried to get her back in and, you know, wasn't strong enough. Um, and a, a paramed, actually a fireman from Salina, Texas, jumped in there and helped and between the two of us were able to get her back in. The woman who lost her life has been named as Jennifer Reardon. The banking executive who was 43 was a mother of two. Flight 1380's crew has been widely commended along with the skill and calmness of pilot Tammy Jo Schultz. Investigators are focusing on a faulty engine blade as a possible cause of a tragedy which could have been so much worse. Neil Connery, ITV News.